Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Andrea Solis here. For those of you that do not know me, today we're going to be figuring out if this $9 Makeup Revolution product is a dupe for this Cover FX $42 liquid highlighter. So I got the shade Champagne from Ulta. I also picked up another shade, um, but the closest shade to this Champagne shade that I have is the Moonlight. And this is absolutely one of my favorite liquid highlighters of all time. First, I want to compare packaging. As you can see, the packaging is extremely similar. They both have the drops on top. They both are in glass type of bottles. Um, and if you know anything about Makeup Revolution, they are definitely the dupers of the more expensive makeup brands. I mean, they've copied tons of... And when I say copied, I mean like literally copied tons of other products from other makeup brands. However, when you're coming out with a product that is $9 versus $42 and they might be duped for each other, I mean, which one are you going to pick up? So let's go ahead and swatch these on our hands. This is the Makeup Revolution in Champagne. And I'm just going to drop a little bit of this on my hand right here. And as you can see, super illuminating. And then we have the Cover FX drop, X drops, drops that I will put right next to it. If you can tell on camera, they look almost exactly the same. So I'll swatch the Makeup Revolution one down my hand, and then I will swatch this Cover FX one down my hand. They look extremely similar. This Makeup Revolution one has more of a pink tint to it though. Um, however, if we blend these two in together, they look exactly the same. So the next step though that we want to test out is how they perform on the skin. So what I like to do when I'm using products like this is I like to pick some up just like I did on the back of my hand over here and just drop it down onto my hand so I can pick it up with a beauty sponge. So I'm just going to pick a little bit of that up with a beauty sponge and the Makeup Revolution will be on this side of my face. So I'm just going to go ahead and dab that where I would normally highlight at. That is beautiful. And then to be fair, we will do the other side. So just picking up a little bit of that on the back of my hand. And then on the other side of the beauty sponge, picking that product up and then placing it. Well, it's showing up more on this side than this side. But maybe I just didn't add enough product. So let's try that again. There we go. To me, they look exactly the same. I mean, I'm talking exactly the same. Let's add a little bit more. We'll just add some this way just to see. So we have the Makeup Revolution on that side and then the Cover FX on this side. Looking straight on with it on my face, this does look a little bit more illuminating than the Makeup Revolution, but let's blend it out and see. So a side-by-side -side comparison, they look pretty darn close to me. I actually think that the Makeup Revolution side blended out easier than the Cover FX side. However, I do feel like this one is a little bit more illuminating than this side, but I would pick this up, seriously, because you can get a ton more shades for the same price that you're going to pay for just one of these Cover FX shades. So let's see, I also picked up the Rose Gold shade and I would like to see what this looks like. So here is the Rose Gold shade and I will place a little bit of that on the back of my hand. Oh, that's gorgeous. This is going to be really great for somebody with a deeper skin tone. I don't think that it's going to look too great on my skin. However, 
this would look really nice as a eyeshadow base. So I'm definitely going to try this out with a eyeshadow look. Moral of the story is $9. I would definitely go pick this up. It has definitely been duped by Makeup Revolution. Um, I'm going to probably go pick up the rest of these shades because like I said, I'm going to be able to pick up all seven of these shades for almost the same price as picking up one of these. And Ulta has sales going on all the time, so I'm sure that you could get these a lot cheaper than $9. Um, but that is it for today's video, you guys. I really appreciate you guys watching. If you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe before you leave. And I will see you guys in my next video.